What's up guys? For today's video, we're gonna learn about the flow of the blood in our circulatory system. So let's get started. You're a superhero. So our circulatory system is comprises with three parts. The blood, the blood vessels, and the heart. So, this is the human heart. Heart is a muscular organ about the size of our fist. The heart pumps blood through the network of arteries and veins. Without heart, we can't live. This is the inner side of the human heart. I drew it in the ibis paint. So, the first flow of the blood is in the superior vena cava and in the inferior vena cava. Next flow is in the right atrium. After that, it goes down into a valve called the tricuspid valve. After in the tricuspid valve, it goes down into the right ventricle. And then, it flows next in the left and right pulmonary artery. The oxygenated blood enters the lungs where gas exchange happens. Carbon dioxide will be carried out from the body, while the oxygen inhaled will be carried back to the heart. Next, it flows down to the left atrium and flows down to a valve called the metral valve. After in the metral valve, the blood enters in the left ventricle and passes through another valve called the aortic valve. After in the aortic valve, the blood enters this giant vessel called the aorta. It is where the blood enters to the rest of our body. The flow of our blood in our circulatory system starts in the inferior and superior vena cava, next in the right atrium, tricuspid valve, right ventricle, left and right pulmonary artery, in the lungs, left atrium, metral valve, left ventricle, aortic valve, aorta, and the rest of our body.